Hey guys, welcome back to Vanguard Motor Sales. I got a special treat for you today. We have a 69 Mustang sitting right here. And yeah, it's a drag pack. She's got the 391 rear end in it. It's got the Super Cobra Jet 428 under the hood and it's Indian Fire Red. This thing has got a boatload of documents that go with it and all the finishes on this thing look like it's brand new. Beautiful, beautiful build on this car and beautiful car back in the day when it first came out. I mean, she is gorgeous. You see all the fine details, everything's lined up real nice. Of course, all that grill looks brand new. The chrome on the front bumper looks brand new. The emblems look brand new. I mean, this thing is absolutely gorgeous. We got hood pins to hold the hood down. We got the shaker on this baby. Everything's fitting nice. You can see the fit and finish on everything just looking absolutely beautiful. And then this Indian Fire Red. This car was born with this color, and I believe this is very, very close to the original color. You can see that all the uh, stainless here, all looking brand new. This car's got the um, spoiler on the back. It's got the uh, louvers on the back window. I mean, this thing's got everything you'd want in a Mustang. And then look at the interior. Of course, everybody knows I like black interior. And this thing is black and she is beautiful. She's an R code, she's a drag pack. It's got all the, it's got all the goodies. We got great looking seat belts in there. She is beautiful. Headliner looks good, the shoulder belts are there. Everything looks correct on the inside. It's got the rim blow horn. She is beautiful and it's an automatic. So all you got to do is mash the accelerator, cook the tires and get on down the road. That paint is just as straight as can be and just as soft as can be. You can see all the finishes back here also looking good. The Mach 1 stripes looking sweet. The Mustang emblem looking good right down to the fuel fill. Check out the pony on the fuel fill. Now, whenever you're looking at a muscle car, you got to look in the trunk. The trunk really tells the story and oh my goodness, the trunk is full of documents. This has got a lot of original documents. It's got a lot of new documents, it's got restoration photos, restoration documents. And if you go to our website at vanguardmotorsales.com, we'll have several pictures, a lot of the key documents. But as you can see, I mean, that stacks about 10, 12 inches tall. So that's a lot of paperwork for a car, man. That fold down back seat there. It looks like we got the jack and the lug wrench in there. All the finishes on the bottom side, right down. Look at this, they put little, uh, they get the little uh, caps right on the bottom of the screws there, isn't that cool? The attention to detail on the car is just amazing. You can see the killer stance on it also. Of course, it's got Magnum 500s on it. Love some Magnum 500s for sure. She is looking beautiful. Now at Vanguard Motor Sales, we do not do any consignment whatsoever. So that means we own this car, guys. And a lot of you may be thinking, what does that mean to you? Most classic car dealers sell on consignment. They sell just about anything that'll roll through the door and they don't know much about the cars. Finding a Vanguard quality car isn't easy. Our team of 15 buyers review thousands of vehicles each month. Our inspectors travel all over the country to handpick each of our cars, which saves you time, money, and frustration. Think of us as your expert hands, eyes, and ears to make sure that you end up with the highest quality cars. We have almost 50 team members here at Vanguard, and every one of us is a gearhead. Growing up around the Motor City, all of our families worked in the auto industry. I grew up working in the garage with my dad, and we worked on countless classics over the years. Around here, cars are a way of life.
let's go for a ride. 391 Super Cobra Jet. Actually, I guess it's a 391 rear end, 428 Super Cobra Jet. I don't want you guys to get confused. <laughs> yeah, drag pack, she's got the oil cooler on her. Got that posi out back with that low gear so you can giddy up and go in your Mustang. I'm in love with this car. Of course, everybody, I think everybody's figured out by now that I'm a Mustang guy. Well, actually, I'd be a Mercury guy. I got a, I got a Mercury as one of my personal cars, and um, my first car was a Cougar, but boy, the Cougar's hard to find. Uh, the male guy wants to see the Mustang go by, so we'll go first. Now, don't forget, Tom can deliver this car anywhere in the world. You just give him a call. He answers his phone seven days a week and almost 24 hours a day, 248-974-9513. And I want to thank all 1.6 million of you who have subscribed to our channel. Thank you so much. Now look down here on the dash, man. You want to talk about original? Everything on this baby is original. She's looking sweet. Looks like all the gauges are working. Now, Marty says this is one of one with an AM radio, so <laughs> you can take a look at the Marty report on our website at VanguardMotorsales.com. This thing's got a boatload of uh, paperwork, and we took pictures of a lot of it, and you can see that on the website. And if you want to keep a real close track of us when we got cars coming in, when you subscribe to our uh, YouTube channel, make sure you hit that little bell button so you get a notification whenever we post a new video. I'll tell you, you can just feel the power behind this thing. I am just barely pushing the accelerator. We're also close to the airport if you want to come join us. Check us out in person. We'd love to have you. It does have power brakes, it does have power steering. You feel it chirp the frickin' second gear, and I'm just barely touching the accelerator. We're right here in the Motor City. Here's our shop. We're located right here in the Motor City at 15100 Keel Street in Plymouth, Michigan. This building is where our team of 15 world-class mechanics inspect and improve every one of our cars. All of our work is done in-house. Our mechanics only service the vehicles we sell. We start with a thorough inspection and test drive. Then our team gets to work. We take the time to learn each car and fix the things that I would fix if it was mine. If that means the engine needs to come out, then it comes out. When you purchase a classic car from an auction or another dealer, in most cases it hasn't been inspected or serviced. You may be in for some unpleasant surprises. At Vanguard, we save you from the headaches that cost you time and money by handling this process for you. Right down the road is our 40,000 square foot indoor showroom. This building is climate controlled and houses over 100 amazing vehicles. We're constantly bringing in new inventory so you never know what might show up tomorrow. We are underneath this beautiful Mustang now and it is just as pretty on the bottom side. We'll start right back here in the back. You can see that brand new gas tank, the brand new looking exhaust. The springs look like rebuilt units. Now, the exhaust looks similar to stock. That muffler is not a stock muffler. It looks a lot more heavy duty than a stock muffler, but it really resembles what it would have looked like back in the day. Uh, we got the Ford 9 inch rear end here. I just rolled it over and uh, counted 391 gear, and it is a uh, posi, so uh, it does have the drag pack gear. We got new brake lines. The guys will still pull the brakes apart, make sure they're in good working order. Now, when you see the center section with the primer on it, that's the way they used to do it back in the day. The drive shaft looks like bare metal. They must have put some um, clear on it. We got the resonators on here. Now, as far as I can tell, these uh, floorboards are looking original to me. I mean, they're beautiful. I still see all the spot welds. I see all the little... Uh, you know how the metal blows out a little bit every now and then when they hit it with the spot welder? I see a lot of that. Everything under here, beautiful. Uh, the C6 automatic transmission, of course, you know, that's what they would have had back in the day. Everything under here is clean as can be. It's got a stock appearing starter on it. 
It's got the uh, cast iron headers on it too. Uh, disc brakes up front. Now, to tell that this uh, motor is actually a Super Cobra jet, it's got the hatchet here behind the uh, harmonic balancer. And the hatchet is kind of like a little throw on the, uh, it's right here, little throw on the crank. You know, it's about that long. That's the way you crawl underneath the car, you see that hatchet, you know you got a Super Cobra jet. Everything under here is just looking brand new. All the bushings look good. Lower control arms, upper control arms. They've got bolt-in uh, ball joints on those upper control arms, so those have definitely been tra uh, traded out for brand new ones. Uh, we got two 15, 65 15s up front. And then look at that wheel well there. Look how nice and clean that is. The attention to detail on this car is second to none. Isn't that pretty? Then when you look down the side, you can see that Indian fire looking beautiful. What's really cool about this is, you know, you're going to pull in a car show. You're not going to see, I mean, maybe one other car, but, you know, it's kind of like red cars, black cars, white cars, green cars. You see thousands of those. Always look at the pinch weld whenever you're looking at a car. Again, you can still see all the spot welds here. Everything just looking beautiful as can be. Now out back, we got some more rubber, sticking some more of that horsepower to the ground. We got two 45 60 15s, and again, those Magnum 500s, brand new, looking sweet. Let's get under the hood. All right, man, that is pretty under here. Super Cobra Jet 428 Shaker. Everything looking great under here. Now you can always tell when you've got an FE when you see how the intake comes under the uh, valve cover there about an inch and a half. That tells you you've got an FE motor, which an FE can be a 427, 352, uh, 428. I mean, there's a couple other older ones. Um, everything under here is just looking beautiful. Now I only see one wire coming out of the distributor. So that tells me it's got uh, points and condenser in there, just like would have been back in the day. Um, everything just clean as can be. Valve covers are all cleaned up looking good. The air cleaner's got all the parts to it. The firewall's nice and clean. Now a lot of the wiring looks like it's original to the car, but it is clean as a whistle for being as old as it is. Uh, we do have power steering. We do have power brakes. Uh, you can see the little cooler for the power steering pump here. And then the power steering pumps were always painted an off-color blue, too. So that is actually correct for back in the day. And then you can always tell you've got a drag pack car having this great big uh, oil cooler up here. You can see everything is just as clean as can be. Now, I did peek underneath that air cleaner. There is a Holly carburetor sitting underneath there. I mean, paint bottom side of the hood, beautiful. I love this car. Give us a call at 248-974-9513 and let Vanguard Motor Sales Park this little dream in your driveway.